Hello guys and welcome to Top Channel 101. So today we're going to be looking at how to make this grapefruit and uh, you can see it here. This is the final product. If you want to look at the reference image and also download the project files for free, you can go to the link I've added in the description, uh, which is going to be to this page here, my Blender Everything page. I post a lot of stuff here if you want to check it out. I'll see the final render, uh, another final render here, the key steps that I'm going to explain in this uh, video you can also find a text version of it uh, the reference image uh, key screenshots of other materials and uh, stuff like that but uh, yeah let's jump in here I'm uh, just going to do a quick overview of the project and then we can jump into the time-lapse so this is uh, the grapefruit and uh, it is made by a few steps uh, we start by making this branch here and then add a particle system to it uh, like this. So the grip is very easy. Uh, what I did is uh, used, used a cube and added a subdivision surface like that and I applied that subdivision surface, added shade smooth, extruded, turned this into a circle uh, just to give this um, better shape. You see how I, how I did it in the, in the time lapse, but uh, that's how I made the grip. And then this, uh, this here was very simple. You just add a plane go to edit mode, merge everything to one vertex, and then use control, control right, right click uh, to extrude, or just hit E to extrude uh, the vertex, and uh, you can make branches like that. And then you can add a subdivision, a, a skin modifier to add a skin like that, and then you can add a subdivision surface uh, to make it look smooth. Go to the particle system, add a new particle system, hair, and uh, we want the hairs to be grown at the tips of uh, the vertices so we need to turn on advanced and make sure under source you have vertices but also make sure that uh, you have this above the skin modifier the particles above the skin modifier so that the particles can show and then you can turn those particles into the grip i like that this is the hard part of our tutorial but everything else is much easier to to follow in the time lapse so i'll just let the time lapse play again if you want to examine the project file look at the materials i'm going to leave a link to this page and uh, yeah also support my my channel by getting texture folder which is an amazing add-on for putting in textures into blender i uh, will see me use it in this project as well let's jump into the time lapse <laughs> 